The two big categories of front-end development are web and mobile. Mobile developers build all the awesome apps that you have on your iPhone or iPad or, you know, if you're, if you're stubborn, whatever Android you have. <laughs> it's true. These are apps with an icon that you have to go to the app store and download on your phone individually and you have to update them every once in a while. These are also called native apps because they were written in a language that's native to that platform, iOS or Android. So those two platforms don't understand each other's languages because nobody knows why. The web is a little different. It's all the websites that you have access to and you can go to from any browser phone, your desktop, your laptop, your iPad, whatever. They don't need to be installed and you don't download any updates for them. You just simply type in the address and you're good to go. It's been a long, exhausting discussion about which one is better, mobile or web. So immature. But there are plenty of good reasons to write both of them. We use similar but different technologies to, to build each of these. Most common for web are HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. For mobile development, we use Swift and Objective-C for iOS, and uh, I believe we use Java for Android. You might ask why wouldn't we use the same technologies to write programs for both web and mobile? That would make sense, wouldn't it? But yeah, the short answer is these two different worlds evolved separately at different times. And you know, some technologies and some tools are just better for certain things. You wouldn't use a hammer to screw anything, right? You would use a screwdriver. So think of different programming languages as what they were intended for and, and nothing more. It doesn't have to be a lifestyle, guys, okay? As of lately, you can write JavaScript to build native mobile apps. Um, although it's a little complicated and it's not the standard or that common yet, although it is getting there. So to start with, we're gonna take a quick look at programming languages that we use to build web apps, including HTML, CSS, JavaScript. Since they're a little easier to get started with and your friends won't have to download an app in order to see your work. All right, so let's go.